some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Marlton, New Jersey, with this particular fraudulent right here known as South Jersey Audits. Now, uh, I've got a little bit of an issue with this fraudulent. I don't know if he's a troll or an actual fraudulent or what, because there's a couple times where he misuses the Pinocchio meme. Uh, it kind of makes me wonder if uh, at the end. But at any rate, uh, he tries to uh, antagonize a uh, postal worker, and uh, well, it ends up being one giant FOIA request, which he doesn't get his satisfaction, and the police are called. And uh, well, even they can't help him out with this particular FOIA request, and he ends up getting denied. So let's go ahead and sit back. Relax and enjoy the show. This building dedicated to public service in 1976. Gerald R. Ford, President of the United States. I'm a Chevy guy anyway. Ah, yes, Gerald Ford, not the greatest president ever, but certainly a better man than any of these frauditors, wouldn't you agree? Can I help you with anything? Oh, no, no, I'm fine, man. I'm good. You just walk around, take... Just you take... take you, you're not supposed to be taking pictures. No, I can take pictures in no, here. you can't take pictures. No, I, I can, no. You're I taking really... it behind the... Well, that's right. Uh, normally, you're not allowed to take uh, pictures or videos inside of a post office unless you are given permission by the installation head. And apparently, this woman is of that position, so she's allowing it this time. But uh, I think she may come to regret it here in the next few minutes. Because, you know, if you give an inch, they'll take a mile. And he's going to take every mile that he can. They can do it from Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah, the rules are right on the wall, dude. You got a post of seven over there. Rules and regulation governing conduct on postal property. Oh, oh don't be so arrogant, you sad sack of crap. I mean, just because this one uh, post office employee allowed you to uh, film in here, maybe because they are the installation head, doesn't mean that you're 100% right on that. So don't act like a complete arrogant fool when the uh, poster doesn't exactly side with you on this. Fast much too early. Prepare to fast forward. Preparing to fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forwarding, sir. Oh, uh, you're in public. What 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 right would make you not be able to be on my camera? Okay, you don't want to. But I'm asking what right is that? What right? I just want if you give me what right it is, I'll leave. Hey, fraudulent, you might want to be careful with what you say here because you are getting into the disorderly conduct phase of your uh, issues right here with the post office. In fact, uh, Poster 7 does have a clause for disturbances, and New Jersey also has a uh, law regarding uh, disorderly conduct. You are treading very close to uh, getting uh, charged with disorderly conduct for the state of New Jersey. 
but you're probably already in the zone for uh, disorderly conduct within the post office. So I'm surprised the uh, officers even let you stay in here when they figured out that you were the uh, source of the disturbances. But then again, uh, not everybody is educated on what Poster 7 actually says. Now, a, lot, a lot of times, even the officers aren't, which they do need to be educated on what actually says, because there'll be a lot less of this BS if they actually knew. There's no expectation of privacy in public. You're in their camera, too. You know, for $40, I could uh, do a open record request and get the footage from this camera from them. Do you want to know why I'm here? Oh, I know, I know, I know. You want to be an annoying pain in the ass and uh, throw your weight around and feel all superior to everybody else because you have no prospects at an actual job or gainful employment of any kind because you're an incompetent moron who uh, decided to go out and commit a bunch of crimes when in, in his younger days and is today paying the price for that stupidity. Am I right? this again try here stop i can but i'm not gonna argue i just wanted to say i'm gonna be leaving now can i just get your name excuse me i can't get your name i was just gonna say that i'm gonna be leaving now the only reason why i was here is if you look at your google reviews you guys are rated a 2.0 and somebody really trashed a woman that has gray hair and a ponytail and i would assume that was you but as long as I've been here, I've been watching you, and I think you are doing an outstanding job with your customer relations up until this moment. I just wanted to get your name so I could put a compliment in for you. Uh, so uh, your whole purpose for this visit was just to watch this one person? Uh, that's That would be on the verge of stalking, wouldn't it? I mean, if your focus is on just her then that seems to be a bit on the creepy side i mean are you a creeper or something like that should we be worried for anybody over here well when it comes to frauditors anything is possible so i'm gonna ask one more time can i have your name no. okay can i do a oprah request and where you can it and i'll get online wow that's crazy I was going to give you a compliment on Google. I was going to call you a postmaster and give a compliment. No, you put it but in then, now. Wow. Some people. I was next in line. Can I help you? Yes. Uh, can I record up here, I absolutely can record my transaction. You can't record up here. I could record my transaction. Record absolutely. Back, sir, I, I could record line. up until this point, actually. I actually, actually is... step about a foot and a half for, forward more if I want. I can't help you. Okay. I just need an Oprah request form. I believe that's what you call it in the state of New Jersey. Well, thank you. Have a good one. Can I get an Oprah request form, please? Yes, you she ran away. Do we have anybody that works here? Okay, anybody work here? Anybody work here? Wow. Wow, guys. This place is cleared out fast. Wow, wow, wow. We might have a story after all, guys. Yeah, there is a story here. Uh, apparently, you've worn out your welcome here by loitering and uh, making it quite clear that you could be stalking this woman at this point. I just wonder uh, 
what your deal is if that's the case. What did she do to you? Why are you specifically targeting her in this particular scenario? All right, well, luckily, OPA request forms don't require a certain form. I could use a piece of paper and a pen and I can make my own. This will work. Okay, guys, please stand by. I'm gonna fill something out here. Hey, for auditor, uh, looks like you uh, want way too much information right there about uh, this woman. In fact, this uh, right here is a part of the uh, New Jersey Records Act, uh, specifically the exceptions. So that information may not be available to you. So, dude, uh, yeah, I can understand if they don't want to release it to you at any point because, well, uh, I, uh, if you're just trying to uh, intimidate this woman, then, uh, yeah, it's probably not going to work. Thank you. Thank oh, you. Wait a minute. It's how you... Oh, awesome. Right. I can take you if you have your camera up. I cannot take you. Yes, you can. No, I, can. I can legally record my transaction with the government. Absolutely, 100%. You can. And I am next. I've been here for uh, quite a while. Time to put an open records request in. You got legalized to show or something? Excuse me? You got a show that you're, you got a camera that you're doing or something? No, no, actually this just came out fairly recently. You, you don't know what's going on, man. This, this ain't like a YouTube type of thing right now, okay? Uh, yeah, I didn't put that Pinocchio clip in there. The frauditor did. Uh, frauditor, are you uh, trying to be a Poe? I mean, uh, are you actually a frauditor or are you uh, just pulling our leg at this point? Because you just pretty much called yourself a liar using that uh, 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 Pinocchio clip in the way you did. I mean, uh, it's kind of confusing at this point. I'm not interested in that. I just want to get in out here. I hear you. Might as well go to another post office. They're not going to serve anybody. This line's going to grow out the door. I can see it now. Anybody work today? Any of our government employees that we pay our taxes to uh, do a job? Oh, we've got a real uneducated moron here today. Uh, dude, uh, you do realize that uh, the post office isn't paid through uh, tax dollars, that uh, how they pay their employees is through stamps and packages and everything like that, stuff they sell to the customers. Uh, yeah, you really need to look this stuff up and do your proper research because you're making yourself look like a complete moron. When you say this is America, do you mean no, me no, or no. them? I just want to know. And I'm not going to start shit. I just, is it me or them? Which one is it? I just want to know. Just get your shit done, man. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm try I can't. I can't leave. Can you just take this? Can you just take this? Really? Okay. I need it time stamped and returned to me, and that's it. I need a photocopy, time stamped and returned to me, and I will leave. As soon as you do that, I'm out the door, and everybody could be served. I just want this time stamped and photocopied. Hey, Frauditor, uh, could you please provide a citation as the exact spot where it says the uh, that you got to have all that done in order to submit the request? Because I've looked all over the uh, Public Records Act for New Jersey, and it says nothing about that. I did just just... What if I leave my phone right here recording? Is that okay? And I walk up there? Is that cool? Say, I smell bacon. Does anyone else smell bacon? Yeah, I definitely smell a pork product of some type. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? Is that cool? I'm just trying to get service here. I've been here for quite a while. They will not give me service. 
Who's been aggressive? It's all, it's, it's all, you ha I've been here for 39 minutes, ma'am. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to be aggressive. I walked in very polite. I'm trying to get business done here. That's it. That's it. Yeah, you could talk. I got no problem talking to you. Let's, let's go back here, man, if you don't mind. Yeah, that's right. My name is James, man. How you doing? Brian, nice to meet you, Brian. All right, you don't mind. I'm going to be videotaping you, man. Are you videotaping me, too? Let me stand back a little bit. To some, I'm a little shaky, man. Yeah, they got me. Oh, my God. Okay, I come in here. I'm an investigative journalist. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> oh, really, dude? You know, this is the first time in this entire video that you have called yourself an investigative journalist. This is the very first time which makes me wonder two things uh why didn't you bring it up with the uh, uh clerk earlier and uh what about your journalistic ethical standards where are they at i mean uh i, I doubt you have any ethics to begin with i mean a lot of frauders don't have ethics okay so it's a, it's a little part-time job i have I have a youtube channel i do investigations all over the country if you look me up but anyway no yeah you know, I'm wondering, uh, are you truly a frauditor or are you just some Poe out there? I mean, uh, I really doubt that you're a Poe because even a Poe wouldn't go out this far and uh, annoy people this much. I come in here because they got a 2.0 rating on their Google, okay? Okay. If you Google for, what do you mean, like, customer service, customer service. Okay. And on the Google ratings, it says there's a gray head lady with a ponytail and they just rip her apart. She is nothing but the nicest lady. I'm telling you right now, she's really freaking nice. Uh -huh. I was here for about 20 minutes recording. People, they didn't give me too much shit about it, but she even told him he's allowed to do it, blah, blah, blah. She's allowed to do it. Okay. She was real nice. I was getting ready to leave. I just wanted to get her name so I could put a compliment in on her. Right, right. She wouldn't give me a name. I said, ma'am, I just want to okay. put a compliment in. They rip you. If you go on your Google right now, they're ripping you. Yeah. I don't see why. I don't see it. You've been nice to everybody I've seen you service, except me now. Right. I just want your name. I wanted to put a compliment in with the Postmaster and also yeah. on Google Reviews. She wouldn't give me a name. I said, okay, so I'll just open request it. Okay. So I, I pull up. I want an open request form. They won't give me a form. Okay, well, open request. Do they have it here? Absolutely. Yeah, it's yeah. a government agency. Okay. Straight up government agency. Straight up, now tell me. I could do it. The ones I could really do it. The ones I could go, I go to your police department. Yeah. I go into any government agency that accepts okay. public okay. funds, and I could do an open request. Oh, okay. I believe that's what you call it in Jersey, right? Open? Yeah, Open Public Records Act. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm used to FOIA or FOIL. Okay. New York is FOIL, F O I L, Freedom of Information Law. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know a whole lot because most of them are FOIA, Freedom of Information Act. I have Jersey's Oprah. I actually want Oprah records. They won't give it to me. Okay, okay. I know Oprah laws. I don't need no specific form. I'll fill it out right here and I'll okay. turn it in. Yes, this is what I'm requesting right now. I just need a time stamp and a photocopy of it, and I will be on my way peacefully. Peacefully. So, so what you want? To, what you want to do? I want that emailed. I want her name. You want. That's my email. Oh, that's your email? That's my email. You, uh, what do you want email to you? I want the woman's name, her most recent pay stub, and any work agreement that she has signed with the United States okay. Postal Service. So, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know how all that works. Let me talk to hey, That's how it works. I see. can tell you right now. I, I, you, I, you're not I you know, FOIA you. laws, I'm, open records. That's not how you gig. I understand that. Yeah, you know how it works, except when you don't know how to look into the exceptions uh, portion of the law and find out that mm, maybe there's some records that you can't request. Which leaves me wondering, how much of the law did you actually read? I mean, if you missed that, then, uh, well, how much did you miss? Did you even bother to read it at all? I mean, there's a lot of questions there. I mean, so far, uh, from what I've seen, uh, you just uh, appear to be totally incompetent when it comes to the actual law itself. I'm a neutral party here. So Understood. I'm, I'm not trying to cause any trouble, trouble, and I'm not going to wait no, cuffs, I'll tell you right you now. Like nice you got a yeah, yeah, nice yeah, shirt yeah. Shirt yeah. Thank you. Shirt. Thank you. Yeah. Um, Thank you. I, I wear for the occasions, man. Um, I'm not going to give any information. I'm not going to give any information. You can never request a... Uh, yeah, I'm not going to give any information. Man. I know my rights. I know my laws. <laughs> Unless you could tell me I'm doing a crime in here right now. Listen, I'm just trying to figure out how, to help, how I can help everybody. I just out. want that time stamped and photocopy that it was received here today, and I will be on my way peacefully. That's okay. all I'm saying. Give me, give me one second. James, yeah. right? Yes, James. Okay. Brian, right? Yeah, Brian. Nice to meet you, Brian.
pass this, pass this part. In fact, never play this again. Try here. Yes. So what I did, uh, we reached out to the postmaster okay. to try to find out because she's been here for a long time. She's never heard of the Oprah. The okay. Oprah oh, film, sorry. Right? Yeah, cool. um, and like I said, the only time I've ever heard of it. You don't need is... a form. I could write it on a piece of toilet paper according to the law. Okay. So what? Okay. But anyway, that's what perfectly the, uh, acceptable. So what he recommended? No, he... no, 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 no. I could do this in person. I'm not doing it online. Okay. Uh, Unfortunately, it sounds uh, like he's not on location. Tell and... him. Tell him to refuse me service. Tell him he's not accepting that right now. That's what you're telling me. I want him to tell me he's not accepting that. I will leave right now, and my lawyers will deal with this. Okay. So, from what the way, the best way that we could try to help you? Nah, I'm not doing it online. I do them all in person. It says uh, in the law you could do them online or which they, law are you talking? About? The Open Records Law, Open Records Act. <laughs> New Jersey. New Jersey, New York. This is, uh, this is a federal. federal it's a federal law. It's a federal law, and depending on the state you're in. Sure I'm recording I'm right now. You guys, you guys, you guys are the law, right? I'm not. I don't have federal law. Hey, you guys are actually out of your jurisdiction right now. Oh no, how does it feel to be so wrong every single time you open your mouth? I mean, come on now, dude, you haven't said anything right since you got in here. Well, maybe a couple things, especially where you can write it down if you want to, but other than that... You haven't uh, been really big on scoring any, uh, well, relevant information or it telling the truth or anything like that. I mean, it's all been a bunch of bullshit so far. Because you know uh, the post office uh, is not off limits to uh, local law enforcement according to the enforcement clause of Poster 7. I mean, you claim to have read Poster 7, but... Have you really? I mean, be honest with us. Have you actually read it? Okay. So the only one doing a crime right now is you guys bringing guns in here, but that's that's one is, point. Is help you with the, they said there's a law department with the post office. If you go to UPS.com. To so she's not accepting yeah. that is what you're telling me. They're not accepting that. Just tell me right yeah, now on camera they're, that they're not accepting they're, that, they're that for they're my not, lawyer. They're no, not accepting yeah. that? No. I will leave right now. Thank okay. you, Officer I'm B. Okay. Brian Strockbine. Strockbine? Sergeant Bob Hansberry. Sergeant Bob what? Hansberry. Badge number? 108. 110. You guys are great, man. You guys have a good day. Be safe, okay? Have a good one. You know what? I need the case number. Alright guys, the United States Post Office here in Malton, New Jersey denied me my open records request. I have been denied to submit an open records request. What's the next step in that, guys? I, uh, I've never had that happen to me before. This is Eversham Police, Evesham Police. Ah, they were a couple nice officers. They didn't give me shit. They researched it, came back with a website. Well, yeah, that's one way of doing it on a website. Another way of doing it is in person. And the United States Post Office in Malton, New Jersey, you're denying me that. Come on now, dude. Do you expect everybody to be trained in FOIA? I mean, do you realize the resources that would draw away from getting uh, all the other work done? Uh, because, you know, they do uh, have specific people out there called FOIA officers that will actually do that for you. I mean, so you just got to submit it to, uh, to the proper person and then it can get done. If you don't submit it to the proper person, then nothing will get done. And apparently the proper person isn't exactly here at this moment. And the simple thing would be to go online and do it, but Seeing as hell the, that you might be too incompetent to do so, you're not going to do it. You want it done your way. Not uh the way that might be the more beneficial way. I mean, did it ever cross your tiny brain that maybe this post office isn't set up for FOIA requests? Maybe they have a central office for that that is more accessible online. Uh, maybe you should actually take a look at the laws and see maybe that you made a mistake or something like that. Nah, that couldn't be it. I mean, you're an infallible frauditor. You're never wrong, except when you're wrong about 
95% of the time in this video. So why don't you go home and cry into your little pillow and get, have yourself some warm milk and chocolate chip cookies and everything like that. And uh, maybe you can start again tomorrow and uh, actually learn the laws or something like that. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Now that we've experienced this moronic frauditor, let's just go ahead and uh, get the bad taste out of our mouths by watching the arrest of a, well, a classic arrest of Press NH Now. So let's go ahead and roll that be beautiful bean footage. Here's your restricted area, no admittance, authorized personnel only. Got a guard shack over here. Man, oh man, frauditors are like a moth to flame when it comes to prisons. Do they want to get arrested and put in there eventually? It is a little windy. I apologize in advance. Habishaw Sheriff's. What's up? Just to make you aware, you can't be taking video and or picture of oh. the facility. Really? Who said that? Uh, state law. Oh, yeah, what law is that? Uh, state law. What law is it? What statute? Because no, there is none, you idiot. Goodbye. You didn't give him enough time to answer that question. You just cussed him out and let him go along his way. So, here, let me show you what the statutes are. But, of course, you won't listen to him anyway, so... But I'll just go and show him. You with the wind. Uh, as a reminder, you cannot be taking video and picture of this facility. Of course I can. I'm on a public easement in right away in public yes, sidewalk. Sir, sir, you're not. Yes, I am. That's the guard line over there. That's your property. That's a public sidewalk. This is a public easement, dude. What's your name? That, go, that sidewalk goes from state property. Hey, Bernathy? State property. It does? Okay, so where are we supposed to walk as citizens? On the other side of the road. On the other side of the road? Yes, sir. Really? Yes, and even then you can't have a camera. Yeah, of course you can, dude. Now. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, I have a right to be out here and video record as a Not citizen. A facility you don't know. Yes. Well, then, I mean, why don't you do something about it? Oh, they will. Don't worry. They very much will do something about it. Because there's nothing you can do. I don't need to. You have no authority over me on the sidewalk, man. I don't know who you think you are, but I'm exercising my rights. Your rights do not extend to. Yeah, that's a policy. Yeah, you have a policy, and I have rights. It doesn't trump Radio that. Rights do not include From a public easement and sidewalk, of course they do. No, they don't. Yes, they do. Then arrest me. I can't exactly. So shut your mouth and just keep it moving, dude. That's some attitude you got right there. Who put that major chip on your shoulder anyway? Many, many minutes later. Good you? Good. Yeah. I'm just taking some pictures. I'm a journalist doing some uh, video recording and some pictures of the facility for a uh, story. Yeah. I got call on you, so that's why I'm trying to see what's going on. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Right. I'm just, I'm on a public sidewalk. What is it? You being aggressive and cussing at him? I'm not going to answer questions like that, no. Okay, just some questions. So. Yeah, well, I'm not going to answer any questions. Yeah, well, I'm on a public sidewalk. You can okay, pull no, your full no, authority. Right. Well, there's walkways right there. Yeah, so I mean, where are those citizens supposed to walk in the middle of the street? Come on, they, dude. They had this bill. Okay, so this, this belongs to the prison. It does not belong to the public, okay? Uh, this right here. So where am I supposed to walk? In, huh? Am I supposed to walk in the street? If it is the one from this time, we want to arrest for trespassing. This is not the one from mine. This time, we want to arrest for trespassing. This is not the one from mine. I mean, I'll. Okay, then I just want to trespass. Well, you can't trespass me. Well, you can't trespass me. Let me see your ID. Well, I'm going to walk over here. Get off. No. I haven't committed any crime. Okay. Well, You're giving I'm, me a warning. Me a name and date of birth. You're giving me, sir. So I'll call a sergeant. Call a sergeant. I have not committed. Look, a, look right here. You gave me. You gave me a warning to get off the right. property. I got off the okay. property. I need your name and date of birth. No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to jail. I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. Do you want my name and date of birth? Put your hands up right now. Okay. Okay. Here you go. No reason, sir. But you know, I'll change three tracks. 
I was on a public sidewalk in, in, in easement. So I have not trespassed on that property one time, sir. Do you have any weapons on I sir? do not answer any, any questions. I'm going to remain silent. I'm going to remain silent, sir. I'm going to remain silent. I'd like an attorney. Huh? I never went on the property, sir. You gave me a warning, I left. This is a public easement right away. I cannot walk in the street, sir. There's no way to walk in the street. I do not consent to any searches or seizures. I swear, I don't know why these idiots think it's okay to film a prison. It's a high security area where we store some of the worst offenders that this country has to offer. I mean, why do that? You're nothing more than a security risk at that point. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?